Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. Many Nigerians are reacting and saying this is huge as the Yoruba actor Sheung Shonjimo acquires a multi-millionaire home mansion in Nigeria and he has joined the list of the homeowners we have in the Nigerian movie industry. Over time, you had Nigerians complain that it is only the females, the actresses, that are acquiring assets, buying house, cares, establishing businesses, and they're not seeing the male actors doing the same thing. So they begin to question, are they not in the same industry? Are they not doing the same profession? How come the females appear more successful than their male counterparts? However, this is changing, as many actors are also doing well for themselves. Sean Shonjima debuted in his first movie in the year 2007 when he starred in the Yoruba drama series Kilanta. In 2015, he came into the limelight after he played a lead role in a long night and also for his role in the X2 he got an award as the best on Hollywood awards in 2016. As a filmmaker he has two movies to his credit, Wendy and The Tale of Two Brothers. He has over a decade of experience in this movie industry and he has featured on the likes of Wendy, The Tale of Two Brothers, The X2, A Long Night, Violated, Klanta, Ileluwa, just to mention a few of them. In the year 2016 he won the Revolution of the Year award at the best on Hollywood awards and he also went home with the best actor in diaspora. And he also went home with the best actor in diaspora award at the fifth AEAUSA awards in 2019. Shonshan Jimo is happily married as he's married to Ola Tokumbo Marafa Jimo. This couple tied the net in the year 2017. And they are blessed with two lovely kids, Anjola Olua and Dola Bomi. And now the family is rejoicing again as this actor has joined the list of the homeowners we have in the industry. Sheung announced this on his official social media platform. He expressed gratitude to the Almighty in his words, Dear God, thank you. I and my family are grateful for your kindness and blessings. Thanks to King's Path Property for a seamless transaction. And since he shared this news, many actors have been congratulating him. And also, some of his fans are also congratulating him on this new acquisition. We're also trying to say congratulations to this Yoruba actor, Shion Shonjima, on this new acquisition. Meanwhile, this year, we've seen many actors joining the list of homeowners. And we have reported some of them recently. The comic actor, Okele, joined the list of homeowners just recently. This movie star is blessed with a lot of talent and he tries his best to put smiles on Nigerians' faces home and abroad. He's a talented comic actor known for his funny acting movie roles. He got his stage name after featuring in a movie titled Akodaoba, where he acted as a king's guard. The name he was called on that movie was Ukele, and that is how that name stuck ever since the, even before he became popular or even before he produced the movie Ukele. Okele, unlike many movie stars, didn't share this news himself. It was shared by another person on social media. And the person said congratulations are in order for the legendary best Yoruba Nollywood actor and comedian Okele on your new mansion. Please help me celebrate him. And they shared some lovely pictures of this lovely home. The other person who became a house owner was the Yoruba actress Bukola Adeyo. Bukola Adeyo acquired a multi-millionaire home and she went ahead to show up the stunning interior of this lovely home. This actress began her acting career when she joined Odula Adeyo Adekola Films production in the year 2008. Since then, she has acted in several movies. The very first movie she acted in was Ilewo and subsequently she began to act in other films. Bukola came into the limelight and recognition after starring in the movie Sunday Daburu. Since then, she has stayed in Omo Adubo, Firisishen Mi, Ajinibe, Sokudai, Kara, Stargirl, and so on. A list of movies now are endless. She is beautiful, gifted, creative, and she's also an exceptional actress. Aside from acting, she's also a movie producer and a mother. She has successfully produced a number of movies, some of them including Ajinibe. She has also won some reputable awards over the years. She won the Most Promising Actress of the Year Award at the City People Entertainment Awards. Her new home is in the heart of Lagos State. It is a beautiful mansion. She is also one of the actresses that have been reported to acquire some fleet of cars. Her net worth has been estimated to be around $300,000. The other person that has acquired new home this year is the Yoruba actress 
Tayo Shubola, popularly called Shooter Gaga, and in fact, she got her own in Banana Island part of Lagos State. It's the hybrid area in Ikuyi, part of Lagos, where the rich abide. Tayo is popularly called Shooter Gaga. And she's a star Yuba actress who flaunts her acquisitions. She also flaunts her beauty, she flaunts her jewelry, designer clothes, designer shoes, houses, exotic hairs, foreign trips. She was among the top 10 actresses living a flamboyant lifestyle. And she does not hesitate to flaunt what she has. Tia Shubala over the years have acquired the best of cars, including brand new Range Rover Evoque, Mercedes Benz, JOK, and some others. She's also uh, one of the actresses who can boast of a state of the art TV production studio. And apart from all those, she's also an entrepreneur. She officially launched her clothing line, Clean Stitches, and her cosmetic products in 2018. She even had to comment on how she pays for her flamboyant lifestyle after so many people were commenting on this and they were asking for a source of income. And this was an interview with Sander Scoop, and in a word, I'm a very hardworking person. And everybody who knows me can attest to that. I'm always thinking of fresh ideas and I'm always on the move. I'm usually so busy that I don't even have time to consider what anybody is saying somewhere. There have been lots of untrue things written about me, but I just decided not to react. I keep my eyes on my goals and I keep moving. There's no one to talk and keep on talking while we saw her. Taya Shobala is also one of the actresses who recently got married. It has been rumored that she is married to an important personality in the northern part of Nigeria. She also added that by now you should know that most actors don't survive on acting fees alone. There are lots of other things involved in the industry, there are endorsements, appearances, other services you can render with your brand. You can also engage in other businesses outside the entertainment industry. Though the economic situation in the country is not so good, there are lots of opportunities out there. You have to open your eyes. The other actor who acquired the property this year is the version of your actor, Dili Udule. This year, Dili Udule finally completed his home in the heart of Ibadan. The time they joined Nollywood was not rosy as they didn't have much watching endorsement deals and uh, lavish acting fees. So, these actors, in spite of all, still were able to succeed and do something positive, a lot of positive things for themselves. This actor, Dele Udule, shared a lovely photo on his official social media platform where he shared that he has been consistent in following his visions and that is the reason why he has constantly been opening his eyes over the years. So these are some of the veterans who have joined the list of homeowners in this year 2021. We have come to the end of this episode where does your back to Shon Shon Jima joins the list of homeowners as he acquires a luxury home, multi-millionaire property in the heart of Lagos. Congratulations to him.